Hey guys, it's Lucas with Rangeland RV here. Um, today I'm going to be walking you through 2022 Wolf Pup 16 BHS Limited. Hey guys, so this is the 2022 Wolf Pup 16 BHS. So first things first is I do want to break down some of the construction for you guys on this travel trailer. So it's actually only 21 feet, nine inches in length and I'm bumper to your hitch pin as well. So that's the overall length. It only weighs about 3,200 pounds. So this is a really awesome light bunk model for any of you campers out there with small trucks, light SUVs. Um, this is gonna fit really well within your towing capacity. So some of the construction on this here, as you can see, this is the limited package. So this comes with your aluminum exterior wall, but behind this wall is where the quality lies. So it's 12 inch on center studs all throughout. That is um, more studs per capita than any of our competitors. Most of our competitors are 16 to 18 inch on center studs. So that leaves big gaps between your studs. So you're gonna lose structural integrity as well as insulation. So the tighter knit stud, much stronger framing along, uh, excuse me, within this travel trailer as well as a much better insulation. Another really awesome feature that Cherokee's doing with our Wolf Pup lineup here when it comes to construction is the floor decking. So it's a 5 8 tongue roof floor deck. Um, most of our competitors are gonna be doing an OSB or a chipboard floor. So that's when in your heavy traffic areas, you're gonna get a lot of these soft spots in your floor. Um, it's much more prone to absorbing water. You can get a lot of water damage in that. So this is actually the same flooring when they build your house that they're putting down. So this is a residential quality build on this travel trailer. Fully walkable roof as well as I might add. So if there's ever any issue to get up there, whatever you have to do, you have no worry about putting a foot through the roof or anything like that. So um, some of the features on this limited package here it is maybe com in comparison to the black label. The black label does have some more options, but you're not gonna find any shortage of options within this travel trailer. So come around here, come around here to the front here and I'll start breaking down some of that for you. So any of our limited tra trailers here are going to be coming with your standard manual jack, but you also do have the option if you maybe have a power drill or something like that, you can put this on and you already have a powered jack there. Um, obviously you're going to have your battery box as well as coming with a propane tank on these units. Um, coming around the front, obviously all of our trailers are going to have four stabilizer jacks in every corner, so you're going to have a solid trailer when you guys are out camping. Um, coming along here, you guys will be able to see our solid entry steps here. So these actually fold up into the frame of the door when you guys are um, traveling down the road versus the old school style where they fold up underneath and after a while they could get all that road grime, maybe start not looking as good after a few years. So this keeps the you know, quality of it over time. It's not getting any of that weather damage or anything like that. As well as you have adjustable legs on here too. So if you're ever camped on some uneven ground, you can extend your legs and still have solid steps all throughout as well. So another thing too, I'm sure you guys have noticed as I'm standing here is the big full length umbrella underneath this travel trailer here with your nice strip light LED um, underneath as well, giving you nice that nice camp lighting at night. Um, even though it's electric, you still do have the full ability to rain pitch this as well. Like I say, fully adjustable arms as well, so you're not losing any sort of option there. Um, again, so some other options here, you have your nice exterior pup kitchen here. So it's just a small fridge, but I mean, that's good for, you know, sodas for the kids, beer for mom and dad, whatever it might be, right? As well as this area here with some extra additional support, you can actually use this as a tabletop surface for maybe um, whatever you can do, prepping veggies or something like that for lunch, right? Um, so coming along here, you guys will see as well, these blue lights here. This is your exterior radio, as well as a mount here for your TV. So you have a full entertainment center outside. So maybe if you're out camping and it's um, early spring and you guys are watching the hockey playoffs, you can still bring out your TV here and still watch the Stanley Cup playoffs outside. Um, and again, one thing I'm sure you'll notice with this trailer is the amount of ground clearance we have here. So one thing I wanna to touch on is the adventure package. So this comes with a much more aggressive off-road tire giving you some extra ground clearance as well as a two inch block spacer built in behind the axle there. So it's two more inches on top of that extra inch with this bigger tire you're getting for ground clearance. And if you even see here, there's some checker plating underneath the wall. So this is actually gonna help protect when all that dirt kicks up when you're traveling down uh, your dirt road to your campsite, you're not gonna be damaging the bottom side of your wall ever getting sort of water, water damage or anything like that. So just another thing that they, um, pay, some more detail that they pay attention to at the Cherokee factory when they're building these. Um, another really awesome option that they're now gonna be standard with all of the Wolf Pup and Cherokee products back here. Coming standard with a backup camera. So whether you're an experienced trailer tower or if you're new to it, I'm sure we can all agree it's nice to have your eyes on your back without having to have a spouse or a friend back there with a walkie talkie. So anyways, we'll go inside here, go over some of the interior features of this trailer.
So as you guys come inside, you can see the nice full-size queen bed here at the front as well. So that's awesome for mom and dad. Um, underneath here, you do also have some significant storage. A lot of people ask me, with it being a small trailer, is it gonna have enough storage? We have a significant storage space here underneath the bed with exterior access as well. But if nonetheless, you can still reach it from the inside, as well as lots of storage overhead here too as well. Some more over top and even actually some additional storage underneath here. You gotta just pull this up and you have a full storage bin as well. Um, so I'm sure as you notice too, when you come in here, this is a trailer without a slide. One of the benefits to that is it's gonna be just significantly lighter. So all you people with the small SUVs, light trucks, you're not gonna have an issue pulling this and you can still house the whole family. You got two big bunks here at the back. Your dinette here folds down into additional bed space as well as the front bed. So I'm thinking you guys will have plenty of sleeping space for any sort of family with a small vehicle. So just looking in the kitchen here too as well, comes with these really awesome, nice residential faucets as well as a very deep 14 inch stainless steel sink. So on a lot of travel trailers, they may skimp out on your sink size, but nonetheless, you're gonna have a lot of space here to do any dishes or wash up after a day of being outside, right? Um, you're gonna have two burners here as well. So you can still do your inside cooking, maybe perk, perk up some coffee in the morning, all that sort of good stuff. Um, these travel trailers also are gonna have Everything you're really gonna to need to be comfortable with whether you're out in the hot weather, you have your AC up here, 13,500 BTUs. So this is actually one of the bigger B, um, AC units you can get on a travel trailer this size. Most of our competitors, it's a small 8,000 one that mounts into your wall, which really doesn't perform well or really keep the trailer cool at all. So another thing too as well, you obviously have your furnace as well. So again, if you guys are out in that late fall season, you guys are still gonna be plenty warm with that furnace running. So one other thing too, I really wanna to touch on with these new Wolf Pups is this fridge space. Especially when you're out camping with a family in a bunk bottle like this, you're gonna need fridge space. So this is an 11 cubic foot foot, excuse me, 11 cubic foot fridge. Um, you're gonna have plenty of storage space, big freezer space. Yeah, pretty much a residential size fridge in a 21 foot travel trailer, pretty impressive. Um, we'll even touch back up here into the bathroom. I'll let the cameraman go inside here so you guys can take a look. You guys will have a full shower, full bathroom, full um, vent up in the roof there too. Pull out any sort of condensation, all that sort of good stuff. Yeah, these Wolf Pups are really packed with a lot of features. Just a few more things to touch on as we walk out here. You'll see here, you see these USB ports all throughout the trailer. There's multiple spots all throughout the trailer. You can actually charge your cell phones and everything like that off your 12 volt battery. You don't need to be plugged in for your, for your, your plugs to work. You can just go to those 12 volt USB ports. As well as you'll see here up in the roof, these are your speakers again, like just on your outside, you have some exterior speakers and even a small subwoofer that's just gonna add to your sound quality and just enjoyment of your time out camping. Um, this is your radio head over here too. Fully compatible with your phone to Bluetooth. You can run, um, run it directly off your phone and yeah, not have to be coming inside to always change the channel. Another cool thing too here with these brand new 2022s, it's this control panel. So these ones here, a much more updated modern look versus the old school small little buttons that never really gave you an accurate reading. You can even um, pair your phone to this as well and do any sort of the electronic features on this travel trailer directly off your phone. You never have to get up from your camping chair. Yeah, this is the 2022 Wolf Pup. It's the smallest and lightest bunk model out of this lineup. You're not lacking quality and you're not lacking options. I think you guys would be really happy with this, especially if you guys are um, have a smaller vehicle or something like that, or you got, like to get out and do some off-grid camping with the amount of clearance on this thing, and you guys would be very happy. Come down and see Lucas at Rangeline RV.